Sponsored by Salud Beer Shop, located at 3306 North Davidson Street in the Noted District of Charlotte. Check out their huge selection of craft beer in bottles, cans, and growlers, and see what's on tap in the tasting room. Salud Beer Shop. Drink real beer. I'm William. This is Dave. We're the NC Beer Guys. We drink beer produced here in North Carolina. Provide our opinions name here on our web blog. Also on our website, ncbeerguys.com. Remember, drink local and keep your beer dollars in North Carolina. We are pleased and proud to celebrate our 100th episode today. Yep. It's been a long struggle and we're very happy to have struggle? done Struggle? Been a hard, long road. Struggle? Drinking beer the whole way. Oh, no, it's horrible. Uh, and we are very <laughs> pleased to celebrate our 100th episode today by drinking the Oscar Blues Mama's Little Yellow Peels out of the Oscar Blues Brewery in Brevard. See, it says right on the can, Made in Brevard, mm -hmm. so we have no problems with reviewing it. As many of you know, Oscar Blues is a, a national so-called known brewery. They have landed in the hill country, and they've said that Oscar Blues Brevard is up and running thanks to their supporters. They're growing at lightning speed. It was time to expand from one giant brewery in Longmont, Colorado. So they've spread out, and they thought it would be fun to find a small, intimate location to open up a restaurant and brewery on a grassroots level. And they landed in Brevard. We were just there, had a great tour. Great tour. They're doing well. They've been a good part of the NC Beer community. And we're uh, more than pleased to uh, celebrate their brew today. Yep. Of uh, the uh, Mama's Little Yellow Peels, is, they say this is an uncompromising small batch version of the beer that made Pilsing Czech Republic famous. Unlike mass market Pilsners, insert your own favorite Pilsner brand. <laughs> Uh, they are not, uh, which are diluted with corn and rice. Mama's is built with 100% malt, pale malt, German specialty malts, and says hops. Size. Size hops. While it's rich with checked out flavor, it's gentle hopping at 35 IBUs and low ABV, it's just 5.3%. Make it a luxurious but low dose by Oscar Blue standards anyway, uh, refresher. So you got a perfect pour. That's looks a, like it. It looks I mean, like look at that. I mean, nailed it because well, it comes because it comes in these little handy containers <laughs> that pours directly into the pills of glass. For cast beer drinkers, we're not used to handling cans. So, so mine, of course, you saw what I had to do. But look at that. I mean, the head retention is beautiful. It's strong little head on there. <laughs> but look at that. I mean, really. I poured a picture. It, it is, it's, you couldn't ask for a better wooden beer and glass, yeah, uh, especially in the Pilsner and the nice Pilsner glass. Yep. This is just an iconic kind of a picture of a beer. Mm -hmm. Let's see, now it, it should not, according to the description, taste like some so-called commercial Pilsners. Okay. It's supposed to be like a beefed up. It's richer, maltier, not diluted with corn and rice. It's a pure Good. malt and hot, it's, it's more, it should be everything we, Used to know and right. more. Rice in beer. <laughs> no. Surely we won't ever be one day promoting those beers. We won't be, and don't call me Shirley. Okay. <laughs> Let's see what we're going to drink here. <laughs> nice little crisp. Yeah, kind of what you would expect, aroma. though, in the Pilsner. I mean, it's, it's a, yep. it smells like beer, a little more than beer. It smells like beer. Yeah. You know, the commercial beer is what I'm saying. Oh. I've drunk a few in my time. Smells like beer. But with a better and more fragrant <laughs> beer back. <laughs> Let's drink it. Now that's got a crisp flavor to it. You won't confuse this with anything you get on the national market. <laughs> no. Uh, this no. is not. No. Uh, this is... This is. <laughs> No, th th this is very nice. This is good. I mean, this is it. You're not, you're not going and getting those national mainstream beers. This is this is totally different. This is why you have craft beer. That's right. Exactly. And the difference in this and and those others, you wouldn't even hardly recognize them as the same kind of beer. No. 
No, this In fact, this particular Pilsner, I don't think it's even a gateway or a crossover Pilsner. There, we've had other craft beer yeah. that is more easily drinkable on the continuum if you're moving from national craft beer, mm -hmm. national beers to craft beer. This is a very substantial Pilsner. It's good flavor. It's deep very, quality taste. Well, yeah, it's very robust. It's, 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 it's still a Pilsner. It's still a Pilsner. It's very robust. It's very, very crisp, which I really like. I mean, I've, I've had some that... And so fresh. Ordinary, yes. As it just cleans, of, cleans right up, snaps up. Yep. No aftertaste. But yet, very substantial taste on the up front. I like that. Oh, and it was a gold medal winner. So, there you go. I've not had this before. I just, I never have had this beer. No, we didn't. We kind of avoided it, as you said, because when you get a brewery, one, that's not North Carolina, then why bother? But uh, they moved in here. We've been to the brewery. It's a very great brewery. It's huge. You, you know, when you go from the smaller craft breweries up to there, you're like, wow. <laughs> you know, when they told us that in their kegging system, they can tap, they could fill a keg in a minute. Like, yes. So uh, we made sure that it did say in Brevard. I'm going to finish my can up. So uh, we wanted to make sure of everybody that we're not going out of our system. And it's not a breaking the barrier uh, review. This is actually in our state. And I'm very glad it is because I really enjoy this. And it's a high quality and it's a, it's a craft beer. Yep. And we're pleased to be associated with it. And uh, I'm going to probably rank it uh, a high bomber. Yeah. I'd give a good, I'd give yeah, it a strong a, bomber. Good, a, a good, strong bomber. That's right. Uh, we're pleased if you follow us along, again, as I said, to have done our 100th episode. One we're looking hundred. forward. We're looking forward to doing a hundred more. That's right. Yep. And as we always say, until next time, remember, drink local. Keep your beard off North Carolina. It and is. It, <laughs> and it is. <laughs> Just check. Yep. Just because you heard the name and know it's in a can, it's still going to be North Carolina beer. Thanks. Uh, and remember, until next time, we'll catch you later, guys.